I swear, Roberto has an obsession with yogurt. I mean, who is gonna eat all that? Stop what you're doing right now. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button. You guys know I have big goals out here. I wanna hit 100K on this YouTube channel. So help me do that by hitting that subscribe button. Follow me on Instagram. Also trying to hit 10K so I can give you guys a swipe up link. Like, that's all I want. What is up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Alexis. I make all different types of content, lifestyle, fashion, cooking, health videos, you name it, I do it. And lately I've been doing a lot of vlogs and you guys know, I love moving vlogs. Like that's kind of how I brought back my channel with moving vlogs. But to me, it's not just moving vlogs. It's like the artistry of redecorating a home and making it yours. It is probably one of my favorite things to do in the world. As you guys know, if you've been here on my channel for a while, I love it. I am obsessed. And right now I am in Roberto's new cute, the cutest apartment in the world. And I get to decorate it. He's given me the reins. He said, this is partly your home. So go for it, decorate it. Cause if it was up to him, he would leave the bed like this. So we have a lot to do today. So today is gonna be a productive day in my life, getting my life back together after a two week beautiful vacation that I just had. If you've not watched those vlogs, they're up on my channel. I will link them down below. So we're getting back on track. We're gonna go grocery shopping today. So do some decor shopping today, clean up the house and just kind of get organized back on a routine, sign up for a gym. And I'm just gonna take you guys with me to show you guys how I live my lifestyle in Europe, just getting things back in order, but also decorating this home and technically doing a moving vlog. Well done, Roberto's here. Oh, in. you got the, wait, finally, that thing was tearing up your car. Tell them how much you love your new house. It's very nice. You're gonna see how nice it gets when we, when she finishes the furniture. Yeah, my, you hear that? You hear that? Interior designer. So like I said, we have a lot to do today, which I'm pretty excited about. I don't even have a desk, I don't have anything, but before we get started, I wanted to make a to-do list of the things that I know I need to get done. You guys know I'm big about this. I love making to-do lists, planning out my calendar. This is something that I feel truly, truly makes me feel better. So I'm a person that has struggled with anxiety. So for me, if I have so many things on my plate that I need to do, and I don't know which way to go or where to start, I'm over here, I'm over here, I'm over here. That's for me really, really overwhelming and stressful and then I just get nothing done. So one thing to knock that out right of the way is to plan out my next couple of days or my week just to get an overview of what I need to do next because that's important. So I know I'm gonna be staring at the computer for a while so I'm gonna grab my blue light glasses. You guys, I love these. I have recently got these and have just been using them nonstop. They're literally my favorite thing ever. Like if you don't have blue light glasses in your life and you find yourself just getting a lot of screen time. Like look at your phone right now, and if your screen time is over an hour, you need some blue light glasses. <laughs> I've been needing to get blue light glasses for such a long time, especially good quality ones. I had ones from Amazon, but they literally don't compare to a good quality pair of blue light glasses. I was on the hunt for some blue light glasses and Felix Gray actually reached out to work with me and I was like, okay, perfect timing. And I love these. These are super, super durable. It's just super cute. I love the way they fit on my face. I got the style in the color black, which I really love. I'll have it linked down below. But they have so many different styles that you can choose from. So if you've ever been scared, like, oh, I want blue light glasses, but I don't know if they look cute on me, they have so many different styles that you can choose from. The reason why I really got into searching for blue light glasses recently is because you guys know I went through a therapy session and my therapist brought on a sleep specialist. And this is what really, really made me like, okay, Alexis, it's time to get blue light glasses. It's not funny anymore. You've been needing to do this and you haven't. This is something that you need to add to your life to kind of progress in the areas you want to progress in, which one of mine is sleep. I have borderline get insomnia and I've had this problem for the last couple of months. And it's really, really bad. And I know a big portion of the reason why I struggle with that is because I get too much blue light at night. She talked about how much sleep we actually need just in general for our mental health and how important it is. And if you're a person that struggles like me with kind of hard time sleeping at night, even an hour before bed, you could be receiving too much blue light. It's good when you're at nighttime to put on a pair of blue light glasses to kind of block that before you go to bed. So what I do is I literally just wear them all night until I fall asleep. And just in general, I work on my computers all day long and I worked a nine to five for about seven years in a bank and I would sit there and look at my computer for eight hours a day for seven years. Like the damage, <laughs> the damage to my eyes is unreal.
unreal and I have used to have perfect vision and now I slightly don't have it anymore and I believe that's a big the big reason why is because I would sit there and strain my eyes all day long looking at a screen so if that is you please do this for yourself get yourself some blue light glasses it's so so important just for your health in general for your eye health I suffer with really really bad migraines I know blue light glasses can help especially if you're staring at a screen all day like yes they're good for you but it can help with actually a lot and I feel like we all walk around not knowing the importance of protecting yourself from blue light now our bodies actually need blue light I feel like we kind of say blue light is so bad but it's not all bad because it's literally everywhere can't avoid it big problem is overexposure at the wrong times that's what we need to avoid that's why I love Felix gray they make it really really easy to understand why it's important to have blue light glasses it's just good to get educated and that I'm not just wearing these to wear these like they actually make a difference for me this definitely I noticed adding this to my routine I'm able to go to bed a lot quicker I'm not tossing and turning as much right before I go to bed that's probably the biggest difference I've noticed once I started wearing these before bed the most blue light we get is actually from our screens most clear blue light glasses will filter up to two to three percent and Felix gray is 15 times more than that that difference between two to three percent and 15 percent is insane what i like about these also they're very portable but also they can be adjusted to your size felix gray's blue light lenses start at 95 dollars for the standard lenses and then you add your prescription at checkout starting at 145 if you wanted to add that in there you can if you don't love them felix gray has a 30-day policy all you got to do is just contact their customer care can take care of any exchanges or returns no hassle definitely give it a try if you've always been curious about blue light glasses try it out i just want to thank felix gray for sponsoring this video obsessed with my blue light glasses you guys are going to see me in these all the time okay so i finished my to-do list of all the things i want to get done i updated my full calendar so today my to-do list is we want to clean the house we want to make a run to h&m home to look at their decor we want to go to a new couch shop we're looking for shopping for a couch for that living room so we want to go look at a few stores for the couch we need to go a huge grocery shop we want to sign up for the gym roberto has to go to the bank and then we put in an order for ikea to get a table so i'll actually just roll the clips from yesterday because i was vlogging yesterday and we did a stop at ikea zara home and we got like the sheets the bedding so we could sleep last night last night was the first night in the house so i'll roll the empty apartment tour and then showing you guys shopping and then i'll do a little haul of what we got before we leave the house Welcome to Roberto's new bachelor pad. We're just gonna cool. have all the girls. Yeah. Here. Huge parties. I'm gonna do a little empty apartment tour show you guys his new place because it's so cute i love it first thing when you walk in is this nice little walkway it has a little storage mm -hmm. closet this place has a lot of storage okay ignore my crap that's everywhere even though we've only been it's here it's already here everywhere it's already my crap, crap. My crap is everywhere already. It's beautiful. Um, my favorite thing is, is the floors, quality of the doors, the handles, the hardware. It's so beautiful. And so first things first is this bathroom. Like y'all, look at this. It is just my dream bathroom. Can we just like, what? <laughs> I'm obsessed. It has a TV in it, but it only plays Portuguese TV. So it doesn't help us. Like I can't connect Netflix. Like I wish, I freaking wish. Nice, beautiful sink. My stuff being everywhere already. Medicine cabinet. This for you. Towel warmer. That's yeah. really common in Europe though. We don't get this in America. This is an add-on in America, but that's pretty common here. You can just really tell they spent a lot of time on the thought process of when they re renovated this. So I love that. So out of the bathroom. You have the one bedroom, so it's a one bedroom. And then you have like this little storage, another storage unit here. All of them have like these lights in them, which is nice. And then you have the bedroom. This is the kind of closet area that's built in. Lights, super nice. And it's like a big, long closet. You wanna open those ones? Yeah, many different styles. They're not all the same, so. It's really nice. And then you walk down this hallway from the bedroom. Super nice. And this is the living room. Super tall ceilings. Very beautiful. It's like one section for the window, but it lets in so much light. So I love. This is the kitchen. Very small, but perfect for Roberto. This is the little refrigerator. This is the freezer down here this is weird for me but this is the washer and dryer in the kitchen two in one two in one 
This is a two in one, an oven and a microwave somehow. Yeah. I think. You have the this is for the trash. trash. And this is the washer. dishwasher. Cute little window, which I love. So that's the empty apartment. It is super, super cute. I think we can do a lot with the space. I think we have to be really, really creative, but it's perfect for Roberto. Let me know what you guys think down below. I love it. I think I love the ceilings. It's my favorite thing. We're gonna keep the color schemes like white, neutrals, little pops of color for the art, really matching with like the ceilings, like keeping that in mind. So if you guys have any ideas, let me know down below. We're gonna eat lunch and wait for the Ikea guy. So I will show you guys that when they get here. Ikea has arrived, the bed is here. The bed is delivered. What the? What is this? So we ordered two pillows. One, we read the reviews and we're like, what's the best quality pillow at Ikea? And there's so many options that I didn't even realize. And everyone was like, this is so good. Get it, it's only $7. This is, I don't understand this pillow. This one, I told him to get just in case. And isn't it better? Well, it's, it's better, babe. It's way better, you can look at that. Like 20 times better. It's not even out of the packaging. This is the brand Pa Tabad. That's the name of the pillow. And I'll have a link down below. Ah. Ah. Well, it came. That's it. We got the bed. We actually decided we're gonna head over to Zara home now to get some sheets or just to see what they have. We're gonna save everything else for tomorrow though because I have to edit the vlog that you guys are seeing before this. So we can't like go out shopping the way I want to right now. I shouldn't be standing with the heart that's so heavy. I shouldn't this one or that one? The They're two different that ones. But they no, 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 that one's one. Not. Might be a little too light. Oh my god, absolutely not. I'm crying inside. So we found a table possibly. This this table, but in this color. Because we know it comes in more than one color. Like look at that. That is so cute. I love it. That's the size of your bed. That's what you need. What are you doing? Are you sure? The first thing that we got was lamps and they're so cute. I'm literally so obsessed with it. And they weren't too expensive. They're more on the expensive side, more expensive than Target, but they weren't like $500 like CB2 for a lamp. I've almost done that, so I know. So we got two of those and they'll go on each side of the bed. Then we picked up him a toolbox. This thing right here, you guys, smells so good do yourself a favor if you can order it offline because i know like it's rare to find a zara home in stores in the u.s but they're all over europe and i love them i can't pronounce that but that is the smell and you guys it has smelled up the whole house we literally opened it and woke up this morning and the entire house smells like this it's crazy i didn't think it was gonna work that well because it's zara but it is so good and it smells so good it's the perfect like mix of a masculine smell feminine smell but also like very soothing and calming at the same time. I really love that. Now we'll do um, Ikea. We actually got two of these comforters. So these are the um, cooling comforters and everyone on TikTok and everyone and their mom is talking about how you make a bed look more fluffy. I really, really want the bed to resemble like hotel bed. Fluffy, really big. So we got two comforters and we slept with one last night. It was really, really nice. It kept me warm, but didn't overheat me, which I struggle with. So if you struggle with that, I would do this. Maybe get two of them to put in the duvet. So then we got some sheets to the all natural fiber sheets 
from Ikea. I'll have all this linked down below as well. Then we got these vases, which I think are super, super cute. Oh, and then I really, really wanted the linen vibe, that the same vibe I have kind of at home for the bed sheets. I wanted more of a linen look to it. We got, the, this is like the knockoff version kind of like the Ikea brand version of a linen sheet and linen duvet. So we went to this store called Area and we got the same kind of like, these are definitely higher quality. These were way more expensive. We'll see, so we got two pillowcases and then the duvet cover. I don't know if this is available in the US, but um, if so, I'll link it down below but it's really, really nice. So it gives you that really linen-y effect, which I think will look good in here or bring a modern vibe. And then we actually got another bed from Ikea and we went to Ikea yesterday and saw it in person. I was gonna do a whole pod project and like re-upholster the bed to white and like do a whole project. Like that's what the bed looks like. And I was gonna change it, but this bed was so cheap that we went and sat on it and it just like, like it feels like it would break even them building it at the store so we we're just like you know what we are probably gonna go with a different vibe because i found on zara they have this cute white headboard that you can just buy the headboard so we're gonna probably order that because i feel like it would go more with the vibe of the sheets that i got and then go to ikea we're gonna return this bed and then go to ikea and just get like a box frame let's get going we have a lot to do today we are finally out of the house i've been in the house i was supposed to leave hours ago but i've been working and finally i got to leave um, I still have work to do when I get home, but we decided to stop at H&M Home really quick. I actually love H&M Home. If you have an H&M Home near you, I don't think they're popular in the US. Like we don't have a lot, so I don't know if there'll be any, but they do have a website, so check it out. It's really good, I love H&M Home, but we're gonna go into the store. We found another linen blend at H&M Home. I kinda like this. Are you great? Well, no, I just like this texture. We got the table and chairs. We're gonna go home and build this. That was an easy process. We just came here, went over there, and just picked it up. Okay, give me the tool. Wow, you did it smart. I'm gonna start from this. Is it stiff? Yeah, it is. You can, no, you clearly didn't. You wanna get to where it's tight, babe, or it's gonna be a wobbly ass table. Oh, this is probably the easiest table I ever built. Woo! We need to see in the morning how it Yeah, we need to see it in the morning how it looks. It's hard to tell because the lighting is so off, but we did the table. Now let's do the chairs. Oh, we gotta do one side first. One side first. I shouldn't be standing with a heart that's so heavy. I shouldn't be up with all the weight that I carry Don't know if it's right, but I'm sticking with you You're my only vice, I'm dependent on you Last one weekend, I know this shit too well I talk, you don't listen, still I'm under your spell I think I'm addicted to feeling bad as hell I can just let you go You're the one I'm I was like, do you want to sit on it? What are you doing? Are you unscrewing it? No, it's, it's, it's traveling. <laughs> wow, no, we did a pretty good job. Yeah, that is. Okay. Wow, it's cute. We built the table and the chair. You can, we have no lighting in there, so it's like literally impossible for you guys to see. So I will show you guys the finished result in the morning. We're just gonna keep building and I'll show you guys what it looks like in the morning when there's better lighting until we get overhead lighting in the, in the room and living room. And then I'll show you a haul because we got a lot of stuff. You got a lot of stuff today. So I'll show you a haul. Just for sticking with you Last for the wicked I know this shit too well I talk, you don't listen Still I'm under your spell I think I'm addicted to feeling bad as hell I can just let you go You're the one I wait for Even though I hate Every time you leave me Leave me to my fate You're the one I'll stay I swear, Roberto has an obsession with yogurt like, who is gonna eat all that? Really? I will be eating all that, clearly. Like, the whole top is yeah. yogurt. It's yeah. It's yogurt. It's all yogurt for me and my belly. What about your food? These will be eaten. These will be gone. 
Is that it? Lemons behind you if you want to in the Okay, so as you guys can see, we just did a huge grocery shop at the store in Portugal called, what is it called? Akan? Ocean. Literally, my main focus for this grocery shop was getting things that I that I just need. I feel like sometimes I over grocery shop and then I don't eat it. We have all of our yogurts and then I have a chocolate milk that I can have for my nighttime snack. I'm getting back on my meal plan. Roberto decided to get all this kaffir and yogurt. I don't know why. He was a little excessive in this area and he better eat it all. And then these are my favorite. I get these everywhere I go. It's just such an easy snack to have on the go. So they're these little like fruit, 100% fruit, boxes and I can have those for my snacks. It's just a good way to get your fruit in or like if you're on the go and don't have a lot of time, you can just grab one of these, which I love. And then we have some milk, juices, sauces in this area. And then we have our fruit, um, some meat, and then we have our vegetables down here, some more meat. And then in the freezer, I put chicken, kind of meats in that box. Fish, I'm trying to eat more white fish than anything in my diet because it's the most lean. So um, I have some white fish and some salmon. And then for my midnight snack, I can have Halo Top. So I, they have that here surprisingly, so I just got some. So as you can see yesterday, we did some shopping, we did a little damage, and I want to show you guys all the things that we got for the house. So first things first is we wanted a hamper basket that would kind of match the marble in the bathroom. So we got this one, this is from H&M Home. I think it's so cute, I love the neutral color. Okay, this is our third duvet cover set that we bought. Luckily, we make sure we can return things we don't want, but H&M Home actually has that linen look of a duvet set comforter with um, two pillowcases, and it's really, really nice. Even nicer than the one that we found at Ikea. Even uh, way nicer than the one we saw at Ikea, but half the price of the one that we got at that really, really expensive store, and I just think it looks better. We're gonna try them and see which one we like better. Then we went to Lush. Basically, we got a body massage bar that kind of like moisturizes your skin in the shower and then some soap. It smells really, really good. I needed a food wear. Maybe a little too dark, but it's just we thought it was cute and different for a food wear. Then we went yesterday and got a Nespresso machine. How come I've always wanted one of these? And I've never bought it. And Roberto was like, oh, there's Nespresso in the mall. And we actually weren't planning on getting it, but we just like walked in and then we happened, they had like a deal, so we ended up getting one. It does everything for you, comes with a frother in it and everything. We love that and it's white, kind of goes with the house. Roberto is a coffee drinker, way more than I am, but we got matcha pods for me. Like how exciting is that? So that is the end of this day in my life, kind of two days. Um, I just filmed my morning this morning because we couldn't fit in grocery shopping yesterday. These videos aren't gonna end here. I'm gonna try to be doing either a week in my life or a few days in my life and just kind of show you guys my life here in Europe which I'm really really excited about I'm here in Portugal the beach is down the street they have a million beaches that we can get to we get to go to all the time 10 minutes away from my house you guys already know our European summer does not end here make sure to follow me on Instagram I'm uploading a lot of reels for my vacation that I didn't put in the vlogs I love you guys and I will see you